Hi, I'm Jamie Barry. I'm a filmmaker from Melbourne, Australia, and we're filming a music video for Wamala for his new song, My Whole Life. Uh, it's a song called My Whole Life, um, and it was written because Claire and I met during lockdown. Uh, she appeared on my TV playing a DJ set for the National Gallery of Victoria, and I sent her a message the next day, and a few months later we were living together. Um, and so it was pretty magical, so I thought I'd write a song, and it was kind of the perfect way to end the record as well. So I think a lot of my ideas come from how I'm feeling at the time. People can get in ruts and I think I just felt like I was in a doom scrolling rut um, where I was just on my phone all the time for no reason. A lot of music tends to be about love for other people where he wanted to focus more on love for yourself and once you find love for yourself then you can finally reach out, people can love you as well. And I kind of saw that as we could do something like that and have technology be in the way of you trying to get to know yourself. So the video begins with the character that Tim portrays being on a solo road trip to an Airbnb cabin. And when he finally gets to the forest, he follows the directions he's been given, but finds that the cabin just isn't there. He's very confused. He heads back out into the parking lot to find that his car's gone and he doesn't know what to do. Basically being forced to be with himself for a very long period of time until he finally started to get to like himself. And once he did, he found what he was looking for the whole time, which was the cabin. Once he got used to not having what he wanted, then he got what he wanted. So whenever I get into a production, uh, the first people I'm calling is Ryan Bell, Jaden De Oliveira, and Liam James. So Ryan's an amazing cinematographer. Jaden is a gaffer, now director as well. Uh, and Liam is a fantastic editor. I work with those three every single project. Yeah, so the camera that was used on the production was the Aria Mirror. Uh, this is actually purchased by Ryan, and this was the first time he used his own camera on a set. You can see the excitement in his eyes, almost like when you have your firstborn child, I assume. <laughs> so for the majority of the shoot, we're using the Hawksy anamorphic 32 millimeter. We get the character's facial expressions very close up, but we're also getting a lot of the scope and the atmosphere around him. And also just kind of skews the edges, making it feel a little bit more surreal. Now we know this, but there are a lot of leeches in forests. I think it was every couple of minutes, you just hear like, ah, and we'd turn around and see someone on set picking a leech off their arm. It was hard to have a call sheet, um, because it was just coordinates on a map. My fingers were tightly wound, hoping that people would arrive on set on time. So a few years ago, we actually did another one of these behind the clips, um, one of my really early videos for rice wine called Growing. And yeah, I, I looked back on that video and I think I was a lot more wide-eyed. And I think back then, my projects had a little bit more comedy in them. And now I've been finding myself doing a lot of videos that are quite introspective and dramatic. These days, you know, it's harder to find time for a lot of people that used to be in your life getting to know myself a little bit more, which is lovely. Less distractions, and I think I just wanted that to be what the video was about. <laughs>